hello. No excuses, haven't got to email. Well, yeah, there is an excuse. There's a reason I haven't gotten to my email yet, Kim. I am struggling with, hey, Shannon. I'm, you're never an afterthought, Shannon. I'm really sorry. It's just, I get most messages from, from Kimmer. Um, and hi to anybody else who might be watching. Um, so I'm struggling with zippers today. Like I've, I'm on my first bag and it is 133 because I have had to tear it out. Not once, not twice. Keep going. Um, also I had to get some stuff out of the tubs that I showed you were on top of that, my bookcase thing, which is all still in disarray. Um, and one fell fell on me, broke my fingernail, tried to grab it, but didn't think and tried to use both hands. So now my other hand is like icky. Um, it fell on my loom and I just about died because I thought, oh my God, please don't break. Please don't break. Cause I have so much money invested in that fracking loom, like $350. But it didn't. Thank God. I was so worried the heddle got broke. Oh God, I would have fucking died. Anyway, sorry about the French. Um, so anyway, so yeah, that's why. But that's not why you're here. So yeah, the, I don't know what it was. I can say it was the intermittent fasting or what, but I've lost two and a quarter pounds in the last two days. So hoorah for me. Um, I didn't do my mile walk today. Yeah, I basically been sat in here on my fat ass and not done anything. Excuse French again. Um, so anyway, yeah. So I have been, clearly I've been trying to make bags here. Let me have a drink. If you hear music in the background, I think that's Luciana Pavarotti. It's Chris, classical Christmas music. And I'm not drinking tea. I'm drinking coffee. Right, so I've been making bags. So I'll just show you real quick because this is kind of a really quick one. Hello. So I'm back. <laughs> I'm kind of copying everything. So I don't know if I just showed this one or not because I had to do another take. But this is the one that I'm tearing out, tearing out. And yes, I do use those quilt clips. Hang on a second. I love this song. And then the blue on blue, blue on blue. And I don't know where I'm going to put these. I'll stick them there. Oh, yes, I did do gaudy on gaudy. Ooh, I did. <laughs> Check out my gaudy on gaudy. I don't care. I would use that bag. I would totally use that bag. And then again, we have, come on, Jenny. Then we have the Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola. And then you said on the red, didn't you, Miss Kim? You said red on red. So the snowman, because there wasn't much of that. You remember that tool with the um, sparkly, um, Snowflakes on? Well, oh, there you go. It's going on the snowman's. And that's going to be a drawstring bag. And then we have this snowman bag with polka dot lining. And then again, we have the outer space bag. That fabric for that bag is like got to be quality because that is the heaviest cotton twill I've ever felt in my life. And then I've got, ah, that's what I did with that. And I've got two of these bags cut. So I used that berry inside there. What do you guys think of that? I freaking love that. You know what, cameras? I will save you one of those. And Shannon, if you want one, let me know and I will send it to you. Um, so... This is that wild, this is that wild sparkly stuff with polka dots. Might as well go all crazy. And that is it, ladies. That is, that's it. I've lost weight. I'm so happy to be kind of back on track. I have a beef roast in the crock pot. 
with garlic powder with herbs in it. And I have carrots cooking in there. It was 95% fat thingy lean beef roast. What else do I have in there? Oh, I've got potatoes in there, but frankly, I don't fancy potatoes lately. I had two days over Thanksgiving time where I really crave potato chips, so I let myself have them. But yeah, I think that's past. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Um, my treat for this weekend is going to be a Coca-Cola because I've been dying for a Coca-Cola and I don't know why. So yeah, so that's about all that's going on right now. Um, no, it's not. Guess what I finished this morning at 4.30. <laughs> I, Kim, I messaged you. I don't know what the hell time it was. It was late here. And I was in bed when you were sending me messages on Instagram about Ian and that picture with his holy socks, which I, you know, fine if he wants to wear holy socks at home. But if I ever catch him wearing those fracking socks, and he won't let me darn them. If I catch him wearing those socks out, I'm going to oh, freak out. Anyway, yeah, that's pretty bad. But that is, he just comes home and does all this slouchy clothes things. And last night, I think work's been particularly bad because he finally got up, got pulls of fabric everywhere. Um, he finally fessed up this morning to the fact that he's frustrated with something. And because he's been a miserable sod for like the last few days and I've been saying dude just tell me what's wrong don't be naughty at me and he's not really being naughty he's just not himself so he's just acting it's nothing personal acting he's just not as I don't know what it is anyway he's he's just been off and he finally told me today that he's not happy at his job and he finally told me why he wasn't happy at his job and I went oh my god why the hell didn't you tell me this ages ago so we had chit chat on the email I didn't give any advice because I haven't been in accounting in a really long time and I can't give advice well I can give advice on that subject but I'm not gonna give advice on that subject because he knows what he's doing he's you know he's he's a corporate accountant so he knows what he's doing and there's his he's not doing okay i should back up and say i don't have any suggestions to help him make it better what he's already made as good as it can get and i have offered to help in an it way if i can possibly help um but he says it's just Hello, bird on my slate roof over here. Um, I can't help if they don't drop a system in that I can work on for him, which I would do for no money. I would just let him take credit for it. So anyway, so yeah, so I'm I'm uh, I'm upset for him. I'm not upset. So we sent a few emails back and forth and I did my usual, oh, you're perfect and stuff because it's Ia's and tried to cheer him up, but yeah. So hopefully things will get better. If not, he has said he's going to start looking because in his initial email before I actually got out of him what was wrong, he said, it's just a dumb place with dumb people. No, it's a dumb place run by dumb people. I was like... <laughs> I think that might be an oversimplification of what's going on. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. And I'm not laughing because I feel bad for him. I've been in places like that. Most recently working with him at, I can't say what school is because I'll probably get in trouble legally. But yeah, so, um... So yeah, I'm feeling bad for him. Um, he is quite happy to hear that there was no turkey tonight and <laughs> that there's a roast in the, <laughs> the crock pot. So I still have turkey in the fridge that I need to pull off the bone and put in freezer bags. That's how much turkey I got. So yeah, anyway, right. Right, so this was supposed to be really, really short and now it's been 15 minutes. I'm so sorry. Um, Intermittent fasting will begin again next Monday. 
Um, I haven't been able to read any real article stuff. I have caught up on a couple of uh, podcasts. Uh, Lose It with Lauren. I really liked her in the beginning, but now I don't because it's... It's not so much about the weight loss thing anymore, which is fine because it's a vlog and it's about her life and, and things. But... Yeah, she's got the nicest girlfriend in the world, and, you know, they seem very happy together, but it seems like since Lauren and her got together, Lauren's put some weight back on, but I think it's just because she's so happy, and it's a happy kind of weight, but I don't think she'll be happy with that. But she is a sweetheart. I do love her. Um, and I have been watching uh, the American Medical Association. So, yeah, just stuff like that. Anyway, we are headed back out to Doctor's tonight, and then we're back here for our grocery store delivery from Morrison's because I had to get a few things. And that's it. So, I'm going to go. Now it's 16 minutes longer than I anticipated it was going to be. But, anyway, I hope you're all okay, and I will talk to you either tomorrow or Friday. Okay. I will talk to you later. All right. I gotta find the button. Talk to you later. Bye.